here's a um, very cool way to quickly and easily and free make yourself a QR code and track it. And for this uh, example, I'm going to use a post on my one of my sites, Tourism Learning Center, 27 Ways to Use QR Codes. Now, I'm using Tourism Le Learning Center because there's a mobile version of this, too. So if somebody's looking at this on a phone, they're going to be scrolling back and forth and up and down and getting seasick. So I know that uh, somebody on a phone uh, will appreciate getting this information. So I want to make a QR code for this post. And the way to do that is you go to a a um, website called bit.ly, B-I-T dot L-Y. That's the whole word, the whole name. And what you want to do is put the um, URL in here. See, it's great big long. And and it doesn't matter so much with uh, QR codes, but you'll see why I want to use Bitly here in a minute. And we're going to shorten that. So you just click shorten. This doesn't cost anything, by the way. It's free. And there it is, okay? Now, here's the secret to this. Click, uh, click on the info page, and it takes a bit, but it'll it'll get up here in a minute, and it will. There you go. Now see, there's my a uh, short uh, URL. There's the actual URL, and now here's here's what's very cool is right there is a QR code that's already been made for you. Okay. And all you have to do is right-click on that, uh, uh, copy the image, or save the image, either one, and it's ready to go into a poster, on a website, whatever you want to do with it. Now, that's how you get the QR code. But you come back, let's, let me go back to the, the other page, and it, let's say here, we want to track this one, and it'll tell you, how many clicks it's got, how many, it, it gives you all the information on it. So you, and, well, this is the one I just did, so it's got no clicks on it. But uh, you, let me see if I can maybe find one that uh, fairly sure has one, has some in, uh, information on it. One click on that one, and it tells you when, and uh, you know, the, uh, and if somebody's passing it around, it's all there. So you can do um, a QR code by just again putting your long, putting any. And here, uh, I just did a QR code for this. It's uh, a, a CVB in Mansfield, West Virginia is uh, doing a website and I made them a game zone to keep you know the kids from being in arcades and all that so let me grab this and I'll copy it and I'll take it back to bit.ly and let's put that in there and shorten it and right there it is so let's go to the info page and kids really, really like these QR codes. They understand what it means. Right there's a QR code. All I have to do is uh, save the image as and put it on a poster or put it on a sticker to put it in the window of uh, stores, whatever the case may be. So that's simply how easy and quick and free uh, this is. So there's really no excuse for you not to use QR codes because now you know how to make them you can make them free and you know how to track them and you can track them free what else could you want thanks